Hello, today we're going to be doing another unboxing and this was kind of a spur of the moment unboxing, or not unboxing, but a spur of the moment purchase um, because I have, um, I think I have, well I have one cross, one foul that's crossed uh, that this is a parent of and then I have um, another foul that this is a grandparent of technically because it's crossed with something else. Um, Kung's Red Cherry is the name, but it's a cross of this and something else. And I got this from Getzen, G-E-Z, uh, G-E-T-Z-E-N on um, eBay. I'll put the information, um, I'll put the information in the description, but they seem to have a lot of imports from like Taiwan. I see a lot of main show um, orchids on there and other similar things. So let me show you what this is. Here it is. Okay, so we have one root. Okay, we have roots in there. I don't know if you can see. Okay, roots. Because so I was a little bit worried on the eBay page. Um, it just had it from the top up, the picture, so I couldn't really see any roots, but um, it has roots in there and it feels secure. But um, this is, as you can see, Fal Jong Jigen Cherry Prince, and this is an AMAOS awarded orchid. And I first saw this orchid on Norman's Orchids, um, and I'll put a picture um, in there. Hold on, actually, let me clean this up. So I first saw this one on um, orchids.com. Norman's Orchids is selling it. However, they are selling um, their mature size plants um, because they're in bloom and it is an awarded plant. They're selling them for $75 starting and I do not have $75 to spend on this particular orchid even though it is very pretty. Um, so I got this one for $35 and then $15 shipping. So it ended up being $50 which is doable. And yeah, here it is. Got three leaves. Hopefully, it's going to um, put out uh, put out some roots, uh, some more roots that'll actually start hitting the size of the pots and stuff like that. But we shall see. Usually, once I put them under the lights, they just take off. Um, but this is a cross, at least with Gigantia. I know for sure it might have some uh, Venosa and Amboinensis in there as well. Um, but I will put a picture up at the end. So um, let me know in the comments if you have any questions or um, comments, recommendations, care recommendations about this orchid. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.